Welcome, today I've done a dash script. Make sure to be su subscribed. We start by setting my rigid body collision detection to continuous. We want our dash to happen when we press two times our move key. In the dash script we need a speed for our dash, a delay for the actual duration and a delay in which we can execute our double press. Our particle to be activated during the dash a public bo boolean to see when we start our dash, called start delay, two int to see how much time we clicked our button, a float to see the time passed from dash beginning and another one for the time passed from the first click, a boolean to start our click time and a rigid body cd. In the start function we set the button press and the rigid body to their basic value. In the update we increment by 1 the button pressed, based on which button is pressed and we start the timer. These buttons are defined inside the project setting input tab. If the timer is started we can increment our time passed after the first press. If it's greater of delay from first press we reset our variable. If we reach then the two press in one of the di direction, then start the delay and instantiate the particle game object. In the fixed update, if we start the delay and so the dash, we increment our time passed after dash start. If this time is lead uh, is greater than the dash delay, we set our x velocity to to speed or minus speed, based on the reaction, else we reset the variable. In the move script we need to disable movement during dash, so we can we use the fixed update function only when our dash dot start delay is false. We access this way to our variable, make sure that the variable is public. You can find the project inside the description. We see in a few days, subscribe.